Just imagine you're sitting in another anatomy lecture when the professor has you get up and assigns you the role of the spleen. You soon find yourself and the other vital organs running around the room demonstrating GI development. This is when you are reminded once again that Dr. Frank Willard's lectures are no ordinary class. I think Dr. Willard is an amazing educator. He has such a passion for teaching and it really shows in the way that he interacts with both the students and um, our fellows and our faculty members. I think one of the things that matters most to me is that he's always listening to us. And so he's always willing to adapt and alter his teaching methods and his style. And that really shows through because over the years he's really honed in on the system. But I love his own curiosity. He'll, there have been multiple times when he's approached us and said, how did that go? What could I do differently? Did that work? What should we do? And that's a, a big part of his teaching style that I both admire and respect. Dr. Willard basically lives and breathes to teach. He's one of the few people I've ever known that truly enjoys what he does for a living more than anything else. He would rather be teaching than even take vacation, and I have proof of that. Since starting teaching at Unicom in 1980, Dr. Willard has been a tireless promoter of the osteopathic profession, both in the U.S. and abroad. He has been a guest lecturer for almost every college of osteopathic medicine, always trumpeting the benefits of osteopathy. I think one of his methods that works pretty well is to sort of push us in the deep end and say, swim, but we're also here to help you swim. Getting that correlation between the very in-depth anatomy and the clinical side that they'll need for third year is really phenomenal. It's, it's something that you don't see in one person. Dr. Willard always goes above and beyond. Uh, one of the stories that uh, I'm sure has been told many times is that you'll find him in his office uh, late night uh, working on some last minute PowerPoint changes. Dr. Willard not only teaches, but he enhances the learning of each and every student. He has a unique way of gauging each student's strengths and weaknesses to help them reach their full potential. At the request of his students, he spent countless hours preparing neuroanatomy videos so that every student would gain a complete grasp of the material. Each video starts and ends with classical music and a scenic photograph, reminding us to have hobbies and keep our balance in our lives. My favorite part about teaching is, is it's actually watching things sink in. All of a sudden, somebody recoils because they realize, yes, and that this is how it goes together. And watching that come together in a class is actually a bit of a thrill. Just thank you so much, Dr. Willard, for all the you know, work you've done with us over my last three years of medical school and now as an anatomy OMM fellow. Um, I would not know anatomy or be so excited to potentially be a surgeon one day without you as my teacher. I just want to say thank you Dr. Willard for inspiring and educating tons and tons of future physicians that are really going to make a huge difference in this world and every time they think of anatomy they're going to think of you. So thank you. Dr. Willard, I just want to thank you so much for all you have and continue to do for us. Uh, we know that you are passionate and that we are, ins are inspired by all that you do and that we wish you all the best. Thank you.